want pumpkins with staying power? Check these out. These pumpkins are faux, not fresh, so you can put them out year after year. And they're just as easy to carve as a real pumpkin. And for tracing, cutting, and etching, a Dremel is the right tool for the job. Get started by transferring a design to the pumpkin. Using the fine tip engraving bit, trace or score the pattern onto the pumpkin. Make sure the paper is pressed tightly against the surface while you work. And once you've drawn the design, remove the paper. Now you can start carving. Use the grinding bit for a unique etching technique that's great for these faux pumpkins. Etching takes away the top coat of color, revealing the white underneath. It creates great contrast and it's easy to do. And if you've got a really delicate design, there's an even smaller etching bit you can use. For a cutout design, use the cutting bit. Try to cut on the inside of your score marks, and if the edges are a little ragged after you've made your cuts, you can use the grinding bit to smooth things out. Cut out the bottom of the pumpkin so you can use an LED light inside for a jack-o'-lantern look. Combine techniques to create one-of-a-kind pumpkins you'll use fall after fall. For the detailed directions, go to lowes.com slash LCI hyphen faux pumpkin carving. Want more great ideas and how-tos? Just click to subscribe. Next up, make a reusable pumpkin web.